Hey y'all, Artist Poet Girl here, also known as APG Jamie. And today we're going to turn this here empty shipping box. See, it has a cool lid. I really like these boxes. I've been saving them. Okay? Into die storage box. I know, it's it's a reach, right? It's a long stretch. So, so you cut that, um, that lid part thing off. Yeah, using a craft knife or crap knife or scissors or whatever makes you happy that you can use with safety. Y'all will see me playing around with that pink uh, craft knife later. Just wait for it, okay? So I'm painting around it with white gesso because I'm going to do some collage on it. Please tell me you're not tired of seeing me collage. And on the inside, I'm just going to make it um, using the uh, black gesso because I want it flat on the inside just because just because that's what I wanted, okay? I don't have to explain to you. No. No. But I did anyway. So, anywho, um, let's see. Yeah, I got nothing. I don't know what I was seeing. So we're just painting along. Look, we're almost done painting the inside. Um, I used, uh, a, to collage on the outside, I'm using paper towels, which will be coming up shortly. These, oh, no, not quite, not quite. We're going to glue this edge first. You know, it's, it's not really loose, but it was kind of gapped open. It didn't make me too happy. So I'm putting a least tacky glue in here and squeezing it set, shut with those little clampy things. Probably came from Harbor Freight. Probably. Yeah, probably. And, uh, yeah, still squeezing it shut. Squeezing out the excess glue. Squeezing glue. Squeezing glue. Here comes the paper towels. Now, these were paper towels that I had um, picked up after I did a, 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 was working on projects down at uh, Christ Church on League Line Road in Conroe, where an art group meets uh, once a month for two, three days. And these were paper towels that we used to sop up pouring paint. And yeah, I snatched them away from everybody. Everybody just said to me like, what is she doing? I get a lot of looks like that. But, you know, they all just looked at me and said, oh, okay, sis, yeah, that's good. We'll see what she does when she does something. Mm -hmm. So I did. Cover this here box. I have, as y'all saw, I have plenty. And, uh have bigger dies. I'm going to make a, another box for that. And I think I'm going to go ahead and decorate the box I have my, um, what you would call it, in, you know, embossing folders. Mm -hmm. Now, my suggestion to help keep from getting that hard line right there is kind of melt that paper away with a little water cutting. Uh, hopefully, I'll um, remember to film that next time I cover one of my other boxes coming at shortly and uh we'll yeah remember to show that it could happen I'm just wrapping around the bottom there using a uh, gloss gel medium because it's what's on my desk i don't know how i accidentally bought it but as you can see i've been using the heck out of it especially on collage and stuff i seem to be doing a lot of collage and stuff lately collage not to be confused with Colleen. Oh, speaking of Colleen, which I'm not really speaking of Colleen. While I was filming this, I happened to have been watching uh, Jean, the musical scrapper. There will be a link below. And also Debbie Epps, who was live streaming also after Jean was done. And uh, yeah, I was watching them while I was working on this project. Notice I said project, mm -hmm. not project. <laughs> Ah. Oh, let's decorate the outside, okay? This uses her rubber stamp that you really can't see that well, uh, especially in the video, because it is a textured surface, being how sorry for all that. I had that problem last time. Anyway, um, because the napkin, the paper towel, kitchen towel, whatever you want to call it, is textured in itself. So it's kind of hard to see the uh, rubber stamping, but it's there. And I'm using some uh, little bubble wrap. And I'm using it like a stamp. I'm putting, you know, putting that uh, PBO orange yellow paint on there with a makeup wedge and just stamping around with the uh, bow wrap there. And here we're making a new tool. 
I had a viewer request and so we're going to try to oblige. This is just a, uh, I'm getting a lot of mileage out of this uh, leftover school folder from, you know, my daughter from like, I don't know, five so years ago. And uh, so I'm just going to make a new little mask type of a stencil type of mask thing. Get ready for the, the pink uh, cutter there plant. Yeah, it will, will, could not get that blade to go back down inside that stupid thing. Okay, Barb. Don't worry about it, okay? No one got hurt. So now I'm going to draw on uh, patiently. I must say it. Oh, drawing these is like the it's like oh, oh, oh. y'all be glad I sped this up. Oh, coming up at the end, it will be a public display. <laughs> Just be ready for it. You have to stay till the end. Okay? Or at least speed through till you get to... <laughs> Let me know what you think, please. <laughs> so now we're going to cut it out. And um, for this kind of sawtooth edge, I'm just cutting all one side. Er, 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 er. Then I spin it around. I'm going to cut the other straight edge on one side. Er, 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 er. I kind of get a little impatient doing this kind of stuff sometimes okay I might have had a piece of candy that day that yeah I think because I filmed it this like yesterday and voicing over today and it'll probably be posted tomorrow next week next is sometime sooner or later edge I won't go into the issues I've had with uh, editing and uh, Windows 10 screwing up uh, various softwares on my laptop so I'm having to now move to the big PC that I can't carry around and sit in the living room and watch TV and edit and junk. So no. Y'all saw how I very uh, delicately drew every single line and now I'm just bypassing, you know, that staying in the line thing because, you know, that's me, APG Jamie. Why would I want to follow the line? Just say. New line. <laughs> Oh, it's a much funkier edge, and I like it. Now, decide what's, where you want this. If you want it to be an edge piece, make sure you flip it the right way because I'm just going to put these little curvy curvy things on the bottom part of the uh, storage box because it's not just a shipping box anymore. It's a storage box, okay? Just in case you need a little clarification. And that's a backup wedge I am using again with the uh, black gesso. And this one got a little soupy and some of the gesso kind of eked up underneath the edge a little bit. So I'm going to have to clean that off. Oh, darn it. Baby wipe time. So just clean it off. He can for a second, y'all. Oh, longer than a second. <laughs> he can, everybody. He can, y'all. He can some more. And uh, now we're going to do that last little edge. This is on, on the... Um, the bottom part of the box and uh, I'm going to use the sawtooth heat gun. I'm going to use the sawtooth around the top part. I'm pretty sure using that paper cutting technique on, on the hard edge where the two napkins join up, I'm pretty sure that's going to help eliminate, uh, eliminate, eliminate, eliminate that uh, hard line to a certain degree. Cross fingers. Go to town. And uh, let's see, our video is slightly over 10 minutes. Please be patient and wait till the end. You won't be sorry. Well, maybe you will, but it doesn't matter to me. <laughs> oh, it made me happy then, it makes me happy now. La la la. So there we go. Slowed it down so you can kind of see. You know, the bottom's got the sort of wavy and the top has got the little sawtooth thing going on. And there it is, stacked up. You got how the box looked in the beginning, how it looked with the white and black gesso, and then how it looked after we got the paper towel on there. Now, just because I can. Ta da! It's time, it's time, it's time, it's time for the musical, musical, musical. Just for you, just for me, just for we. Musical, musical, interlude. So there you have it. <laughs> oh, people, I tell you, you just, I just never know.
Not just y'all may never know. I just never know. Okay, I'm just saying. So yeah, we're just gonna keep on keep on being APT Jamie. So uh, thanks for watching and happy art, y'all.